Those who cling to worthless idols forfeit the grace that could be theirs. Jonah chapter 2 verse 8. Jonah was a prophet of God. God had given him a mission to go to Nineveh and preach to the people there in hopes that they would repent from their evil ways. He didn't like God's plan and decided to carry out one of his own. He tried to run from God, but God found him on a ship heading in the totally opposite direction from Nineveh. God sent a storm that frightened the other men on the ship so much that they feared for their life. The men cast lots to see who might be responsible for the tragedy, and the lot fell on Jonah. When the men came to him, Jonah openly admitted that he was a Hebrew and that he was running away from God. Jonah was so in love with his way that he was willing to die rather than to obey the will of God. He told the men to throw him overboard. Long before I surrendered to this God-given plan of eating that I now follow, I fought it. I thought that there must surely be something more to my liking. Over and over again, I tried to be abstinent on my own and following my own way. My own way was a worthless idol. It took many years of foolishness and pain before I embraced weighing and measuring without exception and saw it as a blessing and not a curse. Thank you, Father, for the many times that you have rescued me from my foolishness. I pray to be forever through with compulsive overeating. Thank you for my abstinence. I trust you for the willingness and strength to take the necessary actions to stay clean, clear, and committed today. It is in the name of Jesus that I pray. Amen. Digging deeper. Read Jonah chapters 1 to 3. Write down all that you can remember from the story. Do you identify with Jonah? Why or why not? What things do you learn about God in this book? Is there something about which you are being stubborn? Have you prayed about it? Have you shared honestly with a prayer partner about it? Have you prayed together about the situation? Have you ever been angry with God? Are you angry with Him today? Have you ever tried to run away from God? Share about the lessons you learned from your foolishness.